Hello there. Uh, thank you for joining me again. Uh, let's get to some reading. <laughs> uh, keep safe. First, you have to be able to take care of yourself. Then you can take care of your family. Intelligence will get you further in life than anything else. Angel Rodriguez. How to protect your home. Step one. Befriend your neighbors. Having a couple of extra set of eyes that are friendly on your home while you're away may secure it better than any high-tech burglar alarm. Get to know the people in your neighborhood and look out for one another. Collect one another's mail when you're on vacation and be mindful of any funny business like a dodgy fella parked outside. It takes more than one person to make a safe neighborhood. Step two, vary your schedule. The more predictable your days and nights, the easier of a target you are. Even if your home is empty from nine to five every day and from the entire month of August when you stay at your in-laws Lake Cottage, make it look like someone is at home all the time. Keep your garage door closed and set your lights on a timer. Step three, secure doors and windows. Make sure they're properly installed and always locked. And install a light outside. Motion detector lights work the best so you can see what's going on if necessary. Step four, live modestly. If you work hard and have the savings, there's nothing wrong with buying and having nice things. Just don't brag about it by positioning all your bling, your Bose speakers, your new iPads, your flat screen TVs so it's viewable from the street. That's just making it an invite for near do wells. Near do wells. I don't know what, huh? Okay. More handy tips. Keep your whereabouts private. Don't post on your front door announcing to your postman and potential burglars that you'll be gone through the next week. If your neighbor can't collect your mail, call your post office and ask them to hold it for you. Don't post your vacation plans online. Sure, your Facebook or Twitter friends will be impressed with your travels, but they can also hear about it and see your photos too when you get home. If you have a gun, keep it in a safe. Locking it up will only help protect you and your family. Invest in homeowners or renters insurance so you'll know your home and valuables will be covered if anything goes wrong. Find out the best plan for you and always keep up to date. If all else fails, get a dog. A well-trained watchdog beats any alarm system. A lap dog might work too, but only if your intruder can be killed by cuteness. You know, I concur with that. All these little tidbits on here. And yeah, I, I concur on every little thing right here. So make sure you're securing your home the proper way. If you do have a security system, you know, there's other layers of security you can uh, utilize as long uh, as is appropriate uh, with the laws. And even um, if you don't have a security system, you can get a dog. Uh, <laughs> even a lap dog, I guess, killing kill the cuteness. <laughs> uh, thank you so much, and I'll uh, talk to you next time.